Welcome back, everybody. At a time when so many families are simply just trying to take care of themselves, we have the story of incredible selflessness from a couple guys on the island of Kauai. They put themselves in peril to help rescue a family dog that took a frightening fall. It's so Sean and Skylar Grace couldn't be more thankful to still have their dog, Jane Porter Grace. Last Friday, they went hunting with their three-year-old hound and were about a mile and a half into the trail when the dogs spotted a pig. What happened next was beyond frightening. And a couple of the dogs split up from the rest of the other dogs. And they, these dogs here went down to, to the cliffs and usually they don't go that far down. But I guess they were pretty close behind, so they keep chasing her. And then they, they caught the pig on the side of the cliff and she went off with the, with the pig. We didn't actually see her go over. We were tracking her with our GPS, um, our Garmin collar. And when we reached to where she was at, she was still moving back and forth, but she had actually gone over the cliff. Because I heard her crying, so I knew she still was alive. They tried desperately to reach the dog using their tracking device and managed to get within about 60 yards. I knew I couldn't go down a steep, steep of cliff. So we came out and I made a call to one of my friends. Call it fate or luck, but the call eventually reached Caleb Morrison and Mark Esposito. Turns out they would become their heroes. The family just really wanted to get the dog back. And because of that, it just was not a hesitation to be involved. Armed with repelling gear and a drone, they spotted the dog and then set out on a rescue mission. She was stranded some 500 feet below without food or water for two full days. They put on their equipment. They rappelled down forever. It was so, so, so steep. We had the location and we were able to find it and use our, our skills, that, you know, things that we do for fun, uh, that we were able to use it to actually help somebody with a purpose. Finally, nearly five hours later, the duo emerged with Jane safely in their grasp. When we got to the top, yes, yeah, seeing them reunited with dog, especially the little boy, uh, Chase, uh, we got a great picture of him bonding with the dog back and you get to see the dog's happiness and the kid's happiness. Despite being hungry and thirsty, Jane was just fine. No broken bones, hardly even a scrape. It's crazy. You know, she came out of there and she's no broken bones and she was a little dehydrated and tired, but that's it. Like, she's, she walked out of the trail. Finally, what do you have to say to Mark and Caleb? Oh, my God, I love them. I'm truly blessed that we even found these guys because, like I said, they did not know us. And the love and the care that they showed our dog when they were saving her all the way up, it's, I mean, it's crazy. And you don't even hear things like that nowadays. I'm so blessed that um, we found them.